What is a microphone? At the most basic level, a microphone is an example of a transducer. This is a device that changes any type of information or energy from one form into another. Another common transducer might be the light bulb, for example. You know, we turn electrical energy into light and heat. Um, as well as that, you could think of the speaker as a transducer. This is almost like the opposite of a microphone. It turns electrical energy into acoustic, where the microphone turns acoustic energy into electric. So we know that sound information exists as patterns of air pressure. These are sound waves. The microphone changes this into information and patterns of electric current. So the purpose of the microphone is to convert the sound wave into an electrical audio signal. So if we take the first example, we've got a guy who's playing the saxophone. The sound is created. This creates vibrations in the air. Those vibrations travel as sound wave through the medium of air. Remember that sound needs a medium. It needs something in which to propagate. So in water or air, sound can travel. Where there's a vacuum, for example, space, sound can't travel. There's no medium for the sound waves to pass through. The microphone then detects those sound waves and via the type of microphone, so is it a dynamic, is it a condenser, is it a ribbon microphone, those sound waves are converted into an electrical signal, which we can then use to say, you know, play through speakers. So transducers, the microphone is a form of transducer, an electrical device capable of converting physical properties into an electrical quantity, such as a voltage or an electric current. Consequently, it converts any quantity to be measured into a usable electrical signal. So like I said, there's many different types of transducers. It turns one form of energy, we apply it through the transducer and we get another form of energy. So you can think of light energy, chemical energy, thermal energy, acoustic energy is what we're going to be dealing with, electromagnetic energy and so on. So in the case of the microphone, you've got your sound source, so the guy singing. We use the transducer or the microphone to turn that sound source into an electric signal. This is then passed in most cases through an ADC, an analog to digital converter. We use our computer processor to maybe record that and store the information on a hard drive. And you might use a software like Logic or Reason or, uh, you know, any other software that's out there, Pro Tools, for example, and we can manipulate that sound source that we've recorded. When we want to play it back through the speaker, we need to use something called a DAC, a digital to analog converter. This then changes it to an electrical signal, and we've got our second transducer, just like a microphone, but the mirror image, and that's the speaker, okay? And then the speaker can produce a sound source and it turns electrical energy into um, acoustic energy.